Balkh is one of the 34 provinces of Afghanistan, located in the north of the country. It is divided into 15 districts and has a population of about 1,509,183, which is multi-ethnic and mostly a Persian-speaking society. The city of Mazar-i-Sharif serves as the capital of the province. The Mazar-i-Sharif International Airport and Camp Marmal sit on the eastern edge of Mazar-i-Sharif. The name of the province is derived from the ancient city of Balkh. Near the modern town, the city of Mazar-i-Sharif has been an important stop on the trade routes from the Far East to the Middle East, the Mediterranean and Europe. Home to the famous Blue Mosque, it was once destroyed by Genghis Khan but later rebuilt by Timur. The city of Balkh and the area of Balkh province was considered a part of various historical regions in history including Ariana and Greater Khorasan. The province serves today as Afghanistan's second but main gateway to Central Asia, the other being Sher Khan Banda in the Kunduz province. Balkh province borders Jaozjan, Sa'e Pol, Samangan and Kunduz provinces, and the Surzondrio region of Uzbekistan to the north. Balkh province is situated in the northern part of Afghanistan, bordering Turkmenistan in the northwest, bordering Uzbekistan in the north, Tajikistan in the northeast, Kunduz province in the east, Samangan province in the southeast, Sa'epol province in the southwest and Jaozjan province in the west. The province covers an area of 16,840 square kilometers. Nearly half of the province is mountainous or semi-mountainous terrain while half of the area is made up of flat land. The Bactria Margina Archaeological Complex. Bactria was the Greek name for the area of Baklo in what is now northern Afghanistan, and Marjana was the Greek name for the Persian satrapy of Magu, the capital of which was Merv, in today's Turkmenistan. The early Greek historian Tesias c. 400 BCE alleged that the legendary Assyrian king Ninus had defeated a Bactrian king named Oxyates in ca. 2140 BC, or some 1000 years before the Trojan War. Ever since the discovery of cuneiform enabled actual Assyrian records to be deciphered in the 19th century, however, historians have ascribed little value to the Greek account. According to some writers, Bactria was the homeland of Indo-European tribes who moved southwest into what is today Iran and into the northwestern Indian subcontinent around 2500-2000 BCE. Later, it became the northern province of the Achaemenid Empire. It was in these regions, where the fertile soil of the mountainous country is surrounded by the Turanian Desert, that the prophet Zoroaster was said to have been born and gained his first adherents. Avestan, the language of the oldest portions of the Zoroastrian Avesta, was one of the old Iranian languages, and is the oldest attested member of the Eastern Iranian branch of the Iranian language family. It is suggested by A. Hers felt that Bactria once belonged to the Median Empire. It was annexed by the Achaemenid Persians in the 6th century BCE and together with Marjanarit, formed the 12th satrapy of the Achaemenids. After Darius III of Persia was defeated by Alexander the Great and killed in the ensuing chaos, his murderer Bessus, the satrap of Bactria, tried to organize a national resistance based on his satrapy but was captured by other warlords and delivered to Alexander. He was then tortured and killed. Alexander the Great conquered Sogdhana in Persia. However, in the south, beyond the Oxus, he met strong resistance. After two years of war Bactria was occupied by the Macedonians. But Alexander never successfully subdued the people. After Alexander's death, the Macedonian Empire was eventually divided up between several generals in Alexander's army. Bactria became part of Seleucus I, the founder of the Seleucid Empire, the famed Bactrian Empire of a thousand cities. Wallowing in wealth, the Greco-Bactrians were so powerful that they were able to expand their territory as far as India. The Greco-Bactrians used Greek language for administrative purposes, and the local Bactrian language was also Hellenized, as suggested by its adoption of the Greek alphabet and Greek loanwords. In turn, some of these words were also borrowed by modern Pashto, the language of Afghanistan. The weakness of the Greco-Bactrians was shown by its sudden and complete overthrow.
first by the Sakas, and then by the Yueshi, who had conquered Bactria by the time of the visit of the Chinese envoy Shang Qian, who had been sent by the Har Emperor to investigate lands to the west of China. Under the Sassanids the province would become part of the area known as Khorasan. Kujula Catfishes, the Guishuang Ziho of the Dar Yueji, united the region in the early 1st century and laid the foundations for the powerful, but short-lived, Kushan Empire, which was then overcome by the Sasnians from Persia. The name Daxia appears in Chinese from the 3rd century BCE to designate a mythical kingdom to Th.